Hello ladies and gentlemen Welcome to the training video of Video Sketchbox Now you people might be wondering that why there is Ultimate Imagizer on the title bar Please don't be confused, this is actually the video sketchbox, it's just the alias I preferred being the developer of the software. So it is 100% video sketchbox. Now let's begin with the tutorial. Let me tell you a bit about the video sketchbox. It's actually a editing tool, a bit more complex than Picasa and a bit more easy to use than Adobe Photoshop. So. I'm gonna explain it and it contains great tools along with a t-shirt designer with drag and drop features I am sure that you're gonna love it let's begin with the software let's begin with importing the image I have here ABC image let's import this image okay here's the image this is the image I want to edit it's very easy to use just drag and drop and resize effects and no more complexity okay we have here some basic tools and effects so let's begin with the hue and saturation tool select this tool and to change the hue and saturation effect you're gonna go ahead and change the threshold button from here and it's gonna change the colors to which you like okay this is good red is good yeah uh, it look very awesome okay now mm, this was the hue and saturation effect I'm gonna undo the effect Similarly, you can put the contrast tool and sharpness tool. Let's just click it. And you see the the image has become relatively sharper. Sepia effect. I'm gonna go ahead and put the sketch making effect, and it will make the sketch of this image. You see, this is the sketch. This is the grayscale effect, and it's the sepia effect of the image okay this was all for the basic tools and effects now I have a drawing panel over here that have great tools this is the pointer tool this will select the image and this is the tool that I've been I was using for the whole time okay now I have a pen tool this is a very powerful tool and even Adobe Photoshop does not have this kind of pen tool this tool have the ability to take the colors and draw draw curves you can see you can make whatever you want by a single click no such pen tool exists in such drawing tools it's very easy to use you, you see the, the the problem of the pen tool in Adobe was that it which is relatively very complex but you see it's very easy to use you can make whatever you want okay I'm gonna go ahead and delete it I have a brush tool brush tool is a tool that can draw image whatever you want you can draw here is the stroke color and here is the fill color if it's stroke tool and if you do not want the filling color then I suggest you put the pencil tool and then draw this and it will just draw the stroke it will not take any fill colors okay this was for the basic tool and I'm gonna just go ahead and delete it okay now here's a text tool and this is a pretty basic tool you can enter whatever text you want a b c d and you can even 
edit this text uh, by going here and changing the fonts changing the size and putting the color and when you cl click it over here it will be changed and now I'm gonna use the pointer tool and drag drop to anywhere you want this is this is for the editing the images and explaining the image with the text this is for such basic tools and we have some shapes palette over here which have basic shapes that most of the just drag and drop simple to use drag and drop pretty cool you can drag some sh other shapes for describe des describing it you can put some text over here uh, as you can see I want this text to be on this then I've gotta order it arrange it to the front front I'm gonna select it to be the front and here you go you can put it there's a cloud image there is arrows there is band and checks and my images and I assure you that I'm going to put more images in it with the upcoming upgrades for the software okay this was just one the this this was just the basic part of the software the main theme just the greatest thing about this software is that it does have a t-shirt designer <coughs> oops that's sorry, sorry I forgot one thing that you can also export the image to a PNG when you're done you just or the name here say when it goes poof that's it okay I'm gonna I was what I was gonna explain okay t-shirt designer this is the t-shirt designer just go over here it will make it will open a whole new software there is no such drag and drop t-shirt designer in the market yet so this is the pretty basic designer you have built-in t-shirts and I'm gonna put more t-shirts and more designs and even the check shirts in it so just drag and drop simple to use I use drag and drop because most of the people don't bother drawing it's the drag and drop level that takes you down and I have some shapes over here that can be dragged and drop over here to make it a proper t-shirt let's just make a cool t-shirt okay here come the glasses okay and mm -hmm. okay let's just put the hat on it resize it drag it drag it oops it's a very large image okay I'm gonna put a hat on it I'm gonna put oh oh man it looks great oh that's great you see you've made a cool t-shirt design with just a drag and draw features and if you want to some text over this t-shirt you can also put the text on it but just clicking over here putting the text I want that person no I am Sherlock Holmes <laughs> okay that's pretty funny uh, oh sorry I'm gonna just make the size larger let's go 22 and let's change the color to yellow okay let's oh sorry no pointer drag and drop wait the font is larger no problem I'm gonna adjust it there you go I'm gonna change the font to some other font call it font the size to Sherlock Holmes yeah man okay here you go there's a t-shirt design 
more tissues can be put over here for a pack of tissues maybe or just <coughs> save the image you can also copy the uh, image and paste over here by just clicking over here too. this was the image I copied and this is the image I pasted over here and I'm gonna delete it okay for the custom image I prefer the JPG image because transparent images sometimes do not work properly so this was it I hope you enjoyed this training tutorial